Let's go. Let's go. I was so hoping, like, yo, the one, like the one time I played Doctor Fate. Please let somebody play Enchantress. Like, I want to see how the shield works. I want to see how the uh, the random hexes hexes work. Right? Like, does she have good setups? Etc. Why you skip the intro? I like what the fuck, man. Oh, nice grab. He's gonna set up a shield. I can do that. Oh, the the demon actually walks back like that? That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool, I didn't know that. I didn't even know that hit from there, that's pretty- uh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, everything is just cool right now. I can at least get multiple- see, the thing about Dr. Fate is I can at least get multiple out, right? No clash? No clash. Ah, oh, nice double hit though. Jumping three would've worked for sure. Like if I was another character that didn't have uh, multiple shots or multiple projectiles, he he hasn't he hasn't done the curses, he hasn't done the hexes, not once. There we go, combo. There we go. There we go. I like that shader. It's pretty cool. No wake up game either. No, like I wanna, I wanna explore. Like I wanna explore how my playstyle is countered by an enchantress. I mean, it's hard of a hard demand because, I mean, the shield isn't too. You could reflect the shield. You could reflect the. I mean, like you could set up the shield, reflect the projectile. But then with Doctor Fate, you're gonna have to set up another game or just block right away. It's not like a, one of those single strong hitting projectiles. Oh wow. Oh wow. Everybody has a pocket Supergirl, man. And literally. Literally everybody has a pocket Supergirl. It's so boring. Like no offense to Supergirl players. Like I have a little bit of a pocket Supergirl, but like she's like the most boring character you could choose. I don't like it. Not at all. Nice. I gotta watch out for Tel- yeah, if I can try to watch out for it. I'm debating if I want to do Wake Up Super, just for funsies. Wake Up Super is really fun to do. Oh, that didn't trade. Call that a beat down. Look at the difference, though. Like compared to like the first gameplay, compared to this one. Like, look at that difference. Oh no, that's so dumb. I thought I could recover fast enough. That's pretty dumb. I just gotta focus, man. I just gotta focus and like chip him out where it counts. This is really doable. Laser first thing. Yeah. He's gonna jump over. Yeah. Called it. Uh, I tried to get a down one and that's the counter. I am the hand 
My whole life defies the odds. I don't care about you. I am the hand of fate. I don't care about you, you whore. Oh, you are not a good guy. You've been told by fate. I am the good guy. That was a bad meter burn on my part. Good jumping three. Good fucking jumping three. God damn. Nice raid. I jumped in because, or like the, the jump in before, I thought he was going to dash in. Because he has a tendency to do that. With Enchantress and Supergirl, he both did um just jump, dash forward, right? So I thought I could get him with like a jumping two, but then uh, I'm glad I did the neutral right after. No, he never baits into my super armored bounce attack. Never baits into it. I gotta stop doing it. I gotta stop doing that shit too. Can't play the close-up game with her. I need to find I need to find a middle ground. Uh, I, uh, I I can't I can't play defensively. I I can't go. I can't I can't do it. It doesn't work with her character. Oh, oh where, where is my teleport? Where is my teleport, man? Yo, you never whiff out back one down three like that. Like, you never do it randomly. What? I pressed a... What? what? Oh, I guess I pressed something. I really should have classed her. Bad input. Uh, he's not gonna clash out all, is he? Nope. Bad round. Bad round. Like, I adapted, and then, like, I didn't adapt, and then I started doing stupid shit. I think my problem with Supergirl is still trying to beat... Like, the mindset that I have is, like, I'm still trying to beat the uh, close-up game. Dr. Fate, he has, like, down one glyph, but, like, it's what what do I do after? How do I open up a defensive Supergirl player? Because most Supergirls are overly aggressive. This one, not so much. He doesn't randomly teleport, either. Still got it out. I'm glad the uh, the the back one two I think uh, the first punch didn't hit only the second one only the second one so I still retain my armor. Ah, oh, that down two should have worked for sure. Nice, nah, nice, nice. That was actually pretty nice. Ooh, this guy is dirty. This guy plays dirty, man.
I uh I inputted my glyph, but then um the crossover, etc. kinda of fucked me up there. Seriously? Seriously? That's really weird. I fucked up. Magic weakens your power. But not my resolve. I could have killed her. If I did like another meter burnable bounce attack, I think I could have got her. Oh, the tight that is the tightest teleport you'll ever see. I knew he was gonna jump. I knew he was gonna do a laser. I put my fucking money on it. I bet everything and the teleport fucking worked. Teleport fucking worked. I'm sorry, like I've nothing against Supergirl players. I just find her really I don't know. I don't know. Cause like you could be a zoner, you can still hate zoning, right? There's a little bit of hypocrisy, but there's a little bit of truth in it, right? Supergirl has good normal pressure, just the resets, and I think on a very like general experienced player, not like a super veteran. Like I'm experienced, right? I'm not casual, I'm experienced, but like Supergirl still gives me trouble simply because of her uh I th I think a lot of it has to do with just frame data. Just frame data, honestly. Some iffiness about it is hard to deal with. Close up. Cause she could do down one frost breath, back one two, back two overhead grab. Uh, when you're airborne, she could like stand you stationary, kind of like a enchantress of standing one. You could be airborne, but then like when they hit you with it, it's still standing. Doctor, it hurts when I go like this. I am not a medical doctor. Oh, much of a straight man. Begin. Oh, I never heard that one before. You know, I don't remember how to play Joker. I don't remember his moves. I don't remember his moves at all. Oh, my strongest corner combo to date. That is my strongest corner combo. With the uh, meter, one meter bounce uh, opening. Seriously, what is that move? What is that uh, wake up move that he does? Like, has iframes or some shit? I've never seen that before. That move right there. Oh, I only got one hit. I shouldn't have wasted the meter. I shouldn't have wasted the meter. Nice confirm. Ooh, what the down? Back at you, boy. Back at you, boy. Okay, he had full meter, he could do... He could have got me in any single combo, or any normal. All he needs is like one or two hit confirms if he reacts fast enough, right? Goes into a super and that's it. I didn't have a... If he juggled me, I didn't even have a um, meter to uh, do an airborne recovery. If I didn't react to the clash fast enough, because I think I still had one. You think you know the future? I gaze beyond the horizon of time. And they call me nuts. Player 2 spot is OP because I start with the interactable. Like, that's a little bit OP.
Nice. This is so cool. What is this guy made out of? Oh, boot to the face. No. Nice. It's just cool, I wanna see it. <laughs> I could have done four or three for a combo, but No, like I need a breather. I need a breather against this guy. I spend a lot of meters too. In that move, when is uh I wonder if I can like I wonder. Nice, nice mix up, because I blocked the, uh, I went, I don't know what I was trying to block there. He could very much play a zoning game and win. Still got two. Nice. Because... Okay, this is the thing that like nobody does. When you hit the when I got the down one confirm, the first one, I could have went into a glyph, but I didn't. So then he he because I didn't combo, right? He blocks the second one, right? I'm still technically negative because down one uh down one on most characters is like a negative one or two, I think. But then I just pressed it again. So then um because I knew he was gonna commit into move. Holy shit, dude, I'm playing against Enchantress, I'm playing against Joker, I'm playing against Grid, like, what is happening, man? What is happening? I should have played more when Enchantress came out, because, like, nobody plays her now, I think. <laughs> the Lords know your fate. I will achieve human emotion. You will fail. But you know when the Joker tried to tra trade projectiles, right? He didn't uh, interval them correctly. So by that I mean I could easily just uh, get the timing and then punish him accordingly. Uh, I tried to do forward two, but then uh, I input it wrong, so I got uh, back two instead. Ah, oh, nice. What is that? Yo, where are all these like new moves coming from or some shit? I don't know. I don't recognize these moves. Or maybe he was a move that he had before? I don't know. I don't know, dude. Oh, nice crossover. That's still dirty, man. That's just an overhead. That's just an overhead, though. Oh, no, I thought I blocked low for that because he doesn't have an instant wake up overhead. Oh, I tried to bait, but. I guess I just didn't uh, press it fast enough. No, that's a weird wake up move. Like, since when does he have that? Dude, was it like, did he have that move in like the beginning of the game? It seemed punishable if I block it. Begin. Yeah, because he always goes for the cancel, usually.
Oh, what? No interaction there? Seriously? Oh, that's such a bummer, man. I pressed R1, but it didn't work. The, um, the thingy there. Doesn't matter. Nice. Nice recovery, though. He got the round anyways. This is fun. I could have went into anything and I could have got the chip there, but I went into a uh, down back three by mistake. Execution error. Nice. He baited. He did. He saw me do it once, so then, uh... I mean, like, if you see me do something once, just adapt it, right? No, but this guy knows his shit. This guy knows his Joker and Cyborg. Like, who the fuck, man? Like, who the hell? Uh, I tried to clash so many times there. I tried to clash so many times, but then he kept doing the reset. I couldn't react fast enough. Good stuff, man. GG. Good stuff. But, like, seriously, Joker and Cyborg? Like, did they have new moves? I know Joker got an upgrade. Like, Joker had some new moves and, like, some weird inputs. They changed some of the stuff. I remember people complaining about it, but, like, oh, I still have one more. Cyborg, though. When the hell did he get that downward sweep? Begin. Did, did they remove the interaction or something? Like, why can't they do it? There we go. It's really weird, dude. Oh, I love that. Love that shit, dude. Oh, wow. Seriously? Oh, man. He probably thinks I'm dumb. And I am dumb. Like I said, I am dumb. Ah, oh, couldn't get the double hits in there. This guy's fun though. This guy's fun. GG. GG. I'm kind of frustrated that I couldn't do any better. I don't know. I feel like the uh, Supergirl match and some of the other... No, but like props to the player, man. Props to the player. I feel brain dead right now. But good stuff, man. Level 53. Smurf account. Solid Joker and the Cyborg. Like, are you kidding me, dude? Are you kidding me? I probably should have done... I don't know, because like Cyborg, if they're constantly doing air projectiles, it's hard to get in. Like, because like... He could do an air projectile, I could do a ground one, but then like he recovers fast enough relatively. I don't know. He hasn't done the missile once. I wish people used the missile more, like it's just cool to see. All right, I wanna do one more. I wanna do one more, I'm not satisfied with that. Like, wh why? Why? Every single time. Every single time. Well, not every single time. I just wanna rematch with the cyborg player, man. Fuck. I don't wanna play against these supergirls. It's always the same shit. It is dumb. Teleport.
Oh, he's one of those, I'm gonna use all my meter right away players. Okay. That was really weird. Yo, I, I'm still facing- what the hell was that? I'm still facing on the same side and I just got a 1 in there, seriously? You can counter teleports like that? Because that's a really weird phenomenon. Because I jumped over and I did a jumping 3, it missed, right? So I'm still facing in the side that I crossed over. But then the guy did a teleport right away without me turning fast enough. So then the teleport was just right in my face and I just pressed 1 and it countered. I've never actually- in all my time of playing, I've never actually seen a teleport counter like that. I haven't done this move in so long. Jesus, what is happening, man? Usually, usually, Supergirl's teleport beats Dr. Fate's teleport, usually. Should I go easy on him? Nah, it's ranked, man. No mercy. I'm not showing you mercy. Nobody ever shows me mercy. It's ranked. If you want, like, no, it's fight. It's a fighting game. You know, like, there's no point going easy on somebody, whether their Smurf accounts, whether they're noobs, or their KDR is really low. Like, there's no really no point going easy on them. They play Swamp Thing. There's no point. <laughs> it's just disrespectful, in my opinion. Like, I just want to play. Anti air, are you tea baking me, boy? Are you tea baking me? I should have done a jumping three. Never do down two with Dr. Fate. It's really ass. Oh, that dodge was so sick, dude! That that back dash was so sick. I didn't even know you could do that fast enough. I can make you work for it. Teleport, raw teleport, or not? Uh, but as much as I would like a rematch with the uh, cyber player, you know, just end the day on a good note. End the day on a good note. Dr. Faye will always be my favorite character. I will always play him the way I want to.